Bill Shields has a closer look at the cleanup after the storm in Marshfield. The ocean had calmed down today, but still seething. Yesterday's anger evident up and down the South Shore. In Hummerock, massive front end loaders were clearing the debris from Central Ave, thrown here by yesterday's monster waves. I keep thinking of what the Jeep people told me. The air filters on the right, keep the water on the left. <laughs> Lisa Case was one of the few people who could get out of Hummerock. She's seen a lot of nor'easters, and this one was just about average, a nuisance. Let's get the roads clear. Utility crews were keeping up with the down lines, but erosion here in Marshfield happened despite the best efforts of DPW crews to build a revetment here. Overall, uh, this was, uh, we, we weathered the storm pretty good. Um, I mean, we had a normal cleanup after the tides. Uh, we'll look at the next tide uh, this evening, but we've had cleanup after the high tide yesterday and last night and then again this morning. So we've had that cleanup going on, but relatively little snow um, in those areas where we had the flooding. The power of the ocean, it's pretty awe-inspiring. But at the same time, it's something that we as New Englanders simply have to deal with. In Marshfield, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.